Welcome to people. Happy Manus Monday. High five. Come here. May this mickle amount of multivalent, maybe majestic M's make you merry. Happy Manic Minute Monday and happy National Leprechaun Day. I don't know why this isn't in March, but hey, I'll need Lucky Charms today. Here we go. First up is a novel by Ernst Vincent Wright that has over 500,000 words but never actually uses the letter E. He is determined to make the English language only have 25 letters. A, B, C, D, E. FG. Ever since Ernest was electrocuted by those eccentrically egotistical entomologists, he's envenomized ease. And apparently it's the world's longest lipogram, which is like a constrained writing game. Worst game ever. Meanwhile, in China. Next up, Florentin Hoffman just brought a 46-tall giant rubber duck to Hong Kong. Splish splash, I was taking a bath. First Godzilla attacks Japan, now a rubber duck attacks China. It's like a Michigan Chillers over there. Up next is what happens when you put an artistic genius in the room with a photocopy machine, you get the music video screen grab. This is the combination of a printer, scissors, a human, and lots of ink cartridges. Epic paperception. This is what somebody with photographic memory sees when they get drunk. And finally is Lonely Deer, an indie pop Swedish singer-songwriter named Emil Savingen. His lyrics feel like poetry with an acoustic background and a subtle electronic seasoning in there. This music is like the secret underground trap door to underground indie music. But every hipster will pretend they've already heard it. Woo! We made it. Thanks for stopping by, guys. I really do appreciate it. Before you go, make sure you like the video below. Comment with your favorite find below. Subscribe! And share this video with your friends. Now go, inspire your souls. And finally, there's a Swedish singer, a Swedish, a Swedish, a Swedish singer-songwriter. Whew.